All right, so we're back to playing Paradise Burns tonight. Mm -hmm. uh, last time, mostly they were hanging out. They found out that Polly and his body had been stolen, and they gathered a team to go find it. And we had to switch out a member of the team because the character wasn't actually done yet. <laughs> mm. So, it's Twain instead of Trinity. Which is fine, because this group needed a guy anyway. Girl power! <laughs> <laughs> you don't approve of Twain, Celine? No, I was just messing. Because you were like, this party needed a, pa a boy. Girl power! <laughs> we are not the Spice Girls. <laughs> <coughs> okay, so you all... Following, I believe Artem's the one that found where it was. Mm -hmm. Following his direction, you find an old abandoned apartment building and you enter the lobby. Which is where you are. What's it doing? I want to get the feeling that we're it's in a creepy. horror movie. What, Danny? No, no it's creepy. <sighs> Yep. What to do, Nevin? Failing, but since nobody's in the room, he's gonna keep trying. <laughs> so crawl up into the ducts. Okay, you may do that. Technically, because he can't leave the little bubble, but yes. <laughs> so, anyone have an idea where to start looking? I'm trapped in this little <coughs> bubble. <laughs> Where does he want to go, Danny? Stalk them. There you go. Okay. I'll pretend I don't see him. You don't, because he's in the air duct. Which is where he hides a lot. It's where he lives. A little bit. Hush you. Can we try doors? You may try doors. Yeah. Quick question for Nevin. Mm. Would you have relocked doors that you've already been through? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Just making sure. I had a feeling the answer was yes. Just be a pain in the ass? Yes. <laughs> It's a door. I found a door. I did find a door. What are you doing with the door? I'm waiting for my internet to work so I can roll investigation on the door. Okay. The door is locked. It does I found a locked door. It does not appear to be trapped. Well, Anybody? anyone? I don't know if we have anyone that can actually open it with finesse. Yes, you would. I could just smash it in. I've got it. Excuse me. Um, okay. If I can move Gloria to the door. I can't. My computer's being weird. There's another door. Yes. Yes, there is. Oh. Come on, computer, do something. Is it locked as well? I'm looking. 
More or less, she's standing to the side, taking her finger and going jiggle, jiggle, jiggle with the knob. <laughs> I don't think, think so. <laughs> else look at it. I found it. Give me a minute. My computer's rebelling. Eris was checking the door. I can't see what you rolled because my computer isn't doing anything right now. 21. It's very locked. Is it trapped? Hey, Nevin, is it trapped? Is he capable of trapping a door? Probably. It's Nevin. Um, look. See if he's got anything to put to the door. I guess those are the doors that... I'm assuming you're going to the ones at the bottom of the room? Mm-hmm. Those are the ones that Nevin would have been through, so... He could have done whatever he wanted to. Then. If he's got stuff to do to it. You have two scrolls and two healing potions there. Yeah, Harmony could have given you something. Yeah. Mm. Ow! Wow, wow, wow. You okay, Celine? Pain in my hand. Well, that was the last door he was at. He probably didn't booby trap that one because he heard them coming. Okay. So which way do we want to go? Anyone? Oh. Come on, computer! Murph. Hi guys. Do we need to stop and I play can't, computer? Ball? I can't even stop. I can't do anything. Oh. Like I can't stop the recording. I can't. I basically see Skype and then blackness. <sighs> Hi guys. How's it going? Pretty good. You guys can still talk, though. Um. No, because we can't really progress. So, right now they're debating about which door to go in. So, debate. Yeah. Debate away. I'm just reopening Chrome. Well. Ebony asked the question, so I'm not going to answer myself. Well, Eris is just like, which one do you think would work? Would... Wait. Which one do you think would be a better way to go? We really don't know much. 
We don't know anything about this place. Exactly. So, making a decision is like flipping Just a coin. Just pick form. one. This is Ebony Yelliger. Make up your fucking mind, you indecisive little twit. There's no need to be rude. Yeah. It's not just me who needs to make up a choice. Well, she didn't hit you, she just swung at you. In other words, MOVE! <laughs> Ebony's the only one she really knew besides Drew and Vaughn. Well, she, then she should know Ebony's personality. You don't yeah. know. No, Ebony's new, you don't know her. Eris is St. Clair adjacent. Okay. She knows Ebony. True. <laughs> Sorry. I might have forgotten that for a second. <laughs> Crimson's cousin. Yeah. I can send something this way. Drew's going towards the lo lower door. I just can't move her yet. So where oh, Ebony is? Yes. The down door. Alright. Ebony's gonna try the knob. Okay. Maybe. She knows it's locked, but that doesn't mean she can't, like, wrench it off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she could probably do that. Well, she rolled a 20. You may have to put enough strength into it to pull the door open. She's like, done. The lock just kind of popped open. And he's like, ta-da. Excellent. <laughs> Like, who needs a fucking rogue? <laughs> uh -huh. You okay over there, Becca? I'm fine. Just reopening cards. Oh, I was wondering what the huh? <laughs> oh, that Thanks. was that was kind of Gloria. Like, I could have opened it a lot cleaner than that. It's open. That's what matters. No, I have to actually let you guys move through it, don't I? Maybe. There you go. You should be able to go. Is there another door? It's open. Okay. Waits for everyone to slowly file through. Sure, you're silly. You should totally be at the back. <laughs> yep. 
Yes. Sure, we'll just stuff everyone in this little room. God, I wish I had a trap prepared for this room. <laughs> it would be so pretty. No, I wouldn't. <laughs> oh, no, they investigated the room. They just all walked in. <laughs> yeah, I don't have a trap prepared, though. Darn it. Now which way? Um... Oh, Drew. I, I don't know. I can sense things both ways. Um, I didn't roll a 25 on perception. Can she hear, feel, anything either direction? Um. Go ahead and roll Arcana. Okay. Let the monk roll Arcana. Mm -hmm. Can anyone else roll? You can roll Perception and then Arcana. Oh, she rolled a 17! Mm -hmm. That's not bad Arcana for her! Yeah, okay, well, you both can sense there is arcane magic coming from both directions. Mm -hmm. But the door over here feels much more necrotic. You can't identify the lower what kind of magic is coming from the lower door. Um, this door feels all spooky evil. I don't know. This makes me think of a horror movie. I'm not quite sure what I'm feeling, but makes me think of when you're watching one of those creepy old movies and all of a sudden a zombie comes out and goes Rah! I am new to this what would this exactly be called? Necrotic? Ah! Feels, feels, feels like death Death! That's it Yeah, <laughs> that's necrotic Oh, it feels necrotic <laughs> <laughs> We can't remember, Nida's been doing this for all of two days more like 20 minutes, but yes. Yeah, okay, sorry. Yeah, literally, Nina hasn't even done this for 24 hours yet. This is the oh. same day, guys. <laughs> <laughs> this is still day one for some of these people. Okay, no. Yeah, okay, Nina, so Nina has not has only been doing this for like 20 minutes. So actually, actually, all of Danny's, all of Danny's characters, this is day one. Ebony's... I'm sorry, but you know my family? Yeah. I have a better understanding of what some of the shit is. If you'd let me finish talking, I was going to say, at least Ebony has some background in it. <laughs> she, she knew this stuff existed beforehand. The rest of them didn't. Um, Twain's Durin, so he might... Mm, yeah, probably. Might have had some knowledge. <clears throat> Alright. I had to look him up again to make sure I was like, yeah, he's this. <laughs> so, yeah, this one feels all spooky, boo, and that one I don't know. I can't even describe what I'm feeling from it. Meanwhile, up in the vents, Nevin is mouthing spooky, boo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Nevin. Anybody else just want to try and sense anything? Uh, Dawn will. Nope! You sense nothing. There's so much necrotic energy, it's kind of freaking you out. No, she had percep- That was her perception. Yeah, she's still rolled shit. Her arcana, a little bit different. Yes, but you'd have to perceive in order to arcana. Okay, let's have Did another- Did Ebony roll a high enough perception to arcana? Yes. But she didn't and Arcana she anything new. <laughs> nope. Especially is just like overwhelming everything. Twain, where is your Arcana? Down at the bottom. Your Jackass, roll your perception and do well. 
guess he's proficient in Arcana. I'm gonna guess Twain. Yeah. Although, guess, <laughs> guess who else is proficient in Arcana at rolled shit? Who? Gloria. Oh. Well, he hasn't rolled his Arcana. Is 12 enough to... He's back in that corner. He's just going based on the fact that everybody else has told him there's magic places. <laughs> Gloria's pointing out where the magic is. Because she rolled really good perception. Nope. Nope. You yeah. jerks! Wow, Twain! You did exactly How what she did. <laughs> the fuck do you have so many skills? He's Twain. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. No, eleven. How the two, fuck does he have that many skills? Four, six, eight, ten. Yeah, he's got eleven. Um, is one of his feats skilled? No, because he's only at level four. Oh. Might be the arrows thing. Might be. That gives him, like, bumped up feats. All right, Olivia, let's see if you can roll. That was decent. That was not decent. Oh, uh, yeah, he has something in his arrow thing called charismatic that means he's, he gains proficiency in all charisma skills. Oh, goodness. <laughs> That's why. <laughs> so, yeah, you guys know one door, necrotic. The other door is magical in some way. Can I check again? You can try. So everybody else has already tried before, and I know this one's spooky boo. Nevin can also roll. Nevin's already been through here. <laughs> he hasn't been through the, the doors. No. He doesn't care. He's just gonna follow them. Alright. Um <coughs> You feel like the other door feels sort of the opposite of spooky door. Oh! That one feels like church. All right. I don't know, like when you go to church on Sunday and you get that whole... Whoa. So, um... the opposite of Spooky Boo? Life or Radiance? Dawn, because she's a life cleric. Yes, I think Radiance is the word you're looking for. Okay, so Spooky Boo in church. I, I should really write down Anita's definition <laughs> of all of the magic that she says. <laughs> you should do that. <laughs> you should do that and post it on Twitter because it's kind of hilarious. Where the hell my pen go? I don't know. Nida, magical terms. <laughs> Spooky Boo in church. <laughs> I kind of just want to list the rest of the things and see what she calls them. Well, she'll eventually encounter them at some point, right? Yeah. But she's the only one who's rolling good enough arcana to feel out everything. Yeah. Can anyone else? Well, since she's already got it, there's no point, right? Right. <laughs> yeah, everybody's already tried to figure it out, and she did it. Eventually. Danny can't remember how to spell necrotic. I got necro. it. I got it, you necro-necrotic. Spooky boo! <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay. So one's necrotic and one's radiant. Which one do you want to go through? Let's go necrotic, because that way, like, if somebody is bringing someone back to life, wouldn't that be, like, a necromancer thing? Yes. Yeah, let's do that way. Are we sure we want to go Spooky Boo? Maybe if we go the other way, we'll find a way to counter Spooky Boo. Because if, if, if something's holy, isn't that the opposite of... <laughs> uh-huh. That is true. But don't we want to stop them from bringing back 
Oh, but Polly? don't we want all of the information? Besides, what's the likelihood that he's not already back? Sorry, I didn't hear what you said. What's the likelihood that he's not already back? Because didn't they say, didn't, um, what's his name? Feel it. His mental presence. His psyche. He felt it, but it wasn't quite right. Like, it, the process had begun, but it wasn't complete yet. You all think we can stop the process? Or do you think that we should look for... Sorry, I couldn't hear you over Celine playing with her microphone. Okay. Yes, Danny? Um, or, you know, should we try to find every possible way to stop it? So, like, if there's something holy down there, it might be a good way to stop the zombie from being risen. I like the way you think. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> that was Drusilla. <laughs> so if we go the, the the church way, we can find a way to put a bullet in the zombie's head before it gets risen. Or, you know, like kneel Dracula back down into his coffin. I have a feeling I'd have spent a lot of time watching movies as a child. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Eris is just looking at her like they don't know a lot of the references you're getting at. Sorry. It's okay. I just have a feeling I'm going to have to play translator. Um, Except for for everybody will understand it all, but a lot of these people aren't just, gonna... just going. Just going. What the fuck's a vampire? Right, we know what vampires are. Yes, you do. What the fuck's a zombie? <laughs> it's... But the vampire reference he got, so he's okay now. Eris <laughs> just looks so, at him. So, let's go get the churchy thing. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Go the churchy way. Nevin's mouthing, go down, go down. <laughs> yeah. Yes, Nevin? He's mouthing it. He's not speaking. Ah! Follow the lady! <laughs> follow the lady, because I'm actually pretty sure she doesn't give you guys light, so you can't see where she's going. <laughs> <laughs> Nina took off running after her. <laughs> She kind of stopped moving for a second. She or stopped. Did you move? She stopped moving because he's at the door. Oh, there's the door. Can she got open? the door open. No. <sighs> door. Somebody's door. 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 Ebony, we have another door. Hush. Nida moves forward. I forgot she's got these neat little weapons on her fingers. Come to a point at the end. So, you can roll dexterity. Okay. Yeah, you can open it. Runs and hides behind the lady. Because <laughs> Nida has finger daggers. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Enters room. Follows the lady. Wait, should we perceive the room first? Yeah. Love Before him. you go in too far, lady. <laughs> My name is Drusilla. Uh, Drusilla. Rolls perception on room. Eh. Eh. Yeah, eh. Eris is trying to look from behind Nida. It's a room. <laughs> Nida. <laughs> Good luck, Nida. Nida sees everything. It's a room with eight pedestals with gems on them, and also something else. What's Nida see? Nat twenty. Yeah, that's why you see it. Ah! 
<laughs> she did not want to be under it. <laughs> Everything okay? I feel like I'm in like a a a, a movie about Greek mythology. <laughs> Don't have light. No. No. Goes to give Twain some light. I lost Twain. He didn't lose him. He's right there. Okay. You think? Okay. Did I give it back? Yeah. You? Okay. There you go. Just gonna move him to this side of your solo to give light to the rest of the room. <laughs> if my computer will allow me. Does it look like a mean kitty? Gloria, Twain, stop making out with each other. <laughs> um, I actually can't move her because you're on top of her. I'm trying to move him! The computer won't let me. Oh, it's because I have to go through the doorway and then over here. Okay. Does it look like a mean kitty? It. Yeah, it looks like it doesn't like you being here. Um... Hi, we just want help. Can you please not eat us? <laughs> I know. It's <laughs> snapping at you. Okay, so first she's gonna roll this. Bad. Okay, then she's just gonna punch it in the nose. <laughs> Snap at her, she's going. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And then kind of leans back into the pedestal a little bit. Okay. Well, it's snap did not hit you, by the way. <laughs> well, she probably didn't hit it either, because she's just kind of swinging at it. No, she hit it. Oh, she did? Ow! Okay. That means combat. It has shit a seat. But yeah. Yay! Combat. Nevin's just gonna watch this from up in the ducks and be like, hmm. Alright, guys. Everybody's like, combat, yes! Roll <laughs> initiative. Aerith! Of course, Nida hit it. Nida! It snapped at me! <laughs> yes, you are out monkeying your sister. It's fine. I swear I turned that off. The tiebreaker? I'm gonna check Nida, make sure hers is turned off. I love it. The experienced since she went first, the non-experienced one, not. Stassi is just like, oh. Just so oh, Drusilla. Uh, yes, tiebreaker is off on Nida. What did Drusilla roll? 14. 14. Well, she still goes before Spezia. My characters yeah. don't want to don't want to fight. They're good. Gloria rolled a seven. She really doesn't want to fight. And chances are she won't. And I was like, I want to meet Dean. Wait, does lightning reflexes give her advantage? Yes, I believe so. <laughs> I rolled a twenty-one. Oh, Nida. Yep. I look up to my big sissy. Uh -huh. Roll ebony. <laughs> yeah, but Nida, so far you're a better monk than your big sissy, unfortunately. Ebony! Ebony! Can Eris give her her ID? No. Okay, the pill. Oh. Dude, it's initiative. I gotta check her feats, though. Nope. Just strength of the gods and lethal attacker. You're not gonna get to fight, even though you're excited. You, you, you were probably got excited. You were too excited. <laughs> you 
You were so excited to fight that you dropped your weapon and you have to spend your first turn picking it up. <laughs> hey! Twain, what the fuck? <laughs> he goes before dawn! Okay. This is the person whose background is librarian. Yep. That's everybody, yeah? Um, yes. Because Nevin's not going to participate unless he feels like he has to. Oh, that nice. He's got Schleinder Freudist. Okay, yeah. the Chimera goes after everybody except Ebony. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, it's not going to get a turn. So, how high are the pedestals? They're like maybe a foot. So he can see over them? Mm -hmm. okay. but the gems are hovering maybe like half a foot above them. Can he see over it? Oh, yeah. If it's not that high, just okay. be, be so, aware of that. Just mark. Temps to hunters mark, I think. Here we go. Well, you have to hit point. Okay. That hit. Damn, do I <laughs> Don't tell me to hit. <laughs> Kills. <laughs> All right. Um, that was your turn, right? Oh, yeah, because he's only level four, and I don't think he gets it for attack. John. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what can you do, Don? Damn it. Okay. Time to move. Great. The one person that's actually really good at puzzles is in the vents and not helping you all. <laughs> Why do you think there's a puzzle here? Because there's eight gems. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you think it's a puzzle? Because it's the room and you're excited that we actually went down into it. <laughs> I am excited. You, you put a lot of work into this. <laughs> That's why she likes the way the Nida thinks. No, Drusilla likes the way the Nida thinks. Oh, okay. that was that was actually Drusilla. Okay. <laughs> All right, and yeah, you moved on. So, Eris. Yep. She's gonna use her. Damn it! I can only use my bonus action for one thing. What's that? <sighs> I can either shift or I can shillele. That's what I'm saying. What you doing? I'm going to flaming spear the bit. Who said it's a girl? <laughs> it definitely did not make that save, though. Hi! Okay, what else can Aris do? She's not going to try to do call lightning because, yeah, no. Not enough room. No, there's not. Um, well, she will cast Shillelagh on her weapon and hold the rest of her turn. Okay, Celine, I believe Shillelagh is a concentration. <gasps> so if you do that, you lose the flaming sphere. Okay, then never mind. Damn it. I have to think. <laughs> Go ahead. Next person. Me! Okay, Nida. Go ahead. Okay, um, mm -hmm. um, oh, that's right. You have that. Yay! What if I put that in? Um, okay. Let's see. Smacks it. Did that hit? Okay, so she has those monkey points, right? Yes, I think you have monk points at this point. Yes, she does. She's got three. Um, <coughs> so she's going to use one to do flurry of blows. All right. 
And she's going to hit it two more times, and then she'll take her last attack, so three more hits. Smack. Smack. Oh, my God. Smack. To my computer, let it smack. Okay. She has the feet called Fiery Fists, which allow her to bring fire through her fists. Mm-hmm. You done, Nida? Huh? Okay. Did I hurt it? Uh huh. How how almost next to dead is it? <laughs> it has twenty five hit points. Oh yeah, I couldn't do that in the flurry blows. So <laughs> no, I don't know. If she did only touch the fifteen twice. She totally could kill it. Um. Oh okay, Drusilla, you're actually using your sword for once. Because it's right next to her. Yeah. I never use this, but apparently I know how to hit with it. Are you fucking kidding me? One hit how many hit points? Two, it has two hit points left. That's fast here. Just, just whack it. Just like tap it. That'll probably do it. <laughs> Sadly, that matched. <laughs> I can't hit! <laughs> I can't hit! Hey, Eris, you're holding your turn, Wait. right? Do a spell! <laughs> Actually, I have a banked shield bash. No, you've already used both of your... Yeah. yeah. I was gonna... Damn it. Luffy is gonna get the kill, because she's gonna just magic missile it. That's not fair! <laughs> I forgot I had a banked. I, I, I did the most damage, right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Shoved it over there. <laughs> So, Knight is the monkiest monk we've had in the longest time. Yep. She manages to hit with her fists more than any other monk I think we've played. Um, <laughs> I have a monk in my head that is saying that's not even fair. Uh, who? Arya. And I have another one in my head somewhere. Who are you? Anyway, anyways, Naya does better consistently. Arya did until she hit got held person. Hey, Arya, you're also level ten. Your daughter's only level four. True. Oh uh, shoot! See, um, does she know anything else about the room? Nope. Because of the nat 20, or just... You just noticed not, what was in it. Nothing on the stones that she noticed? Is there anything? Nope. I have a feeling we need to do something in here. Because <laughs> this is the churchy power. Mm-hmm. Hello, right, Nevin. Roll another stealth, just because you're moving around. I must. You must. <sighs> well, good thing Nevin wasn't moving when Ida rolled perception. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna give my computer a minute. Okay. I thought your comment was because he'd like already rolled and not done good. I'm like, I don't see anything. <laughs> <Don't tell. laughs> He's still for a minute. Anybody may roll perception if they want. <laughs> Nobody cares. They're too focused on finding the churchy power. Awesome. Oh, he probably gonna... ran there during the combat, but I couldn't really. Yeah. Move him without <laughs> disrupting myself. So, probably use the combat as the cover to get to a different location. Possibly. That arc. I'm gonna use... So now he's just gonna sit still. I was just gonna do perception to see what's about the gems. Investigation. Investigation. 
God damn it, Nevin. Fall out of the vents. They need you. <laughs> but would he help? No. <laughs> hmm. It's not what he's been instructed to do. None of my characters can do it. Yeah, they're just gems. Floating around. Nothing special about them at all. There's something special about them. We just still have don't two know. people to roll, thank you. I was responding to Celine's characters. Oh. I didn't know you'd even rolled yet. Alright, Twain. Do something. Aside from go first. <laughs> I'm waiting for my computer to let me roll up, roll up and find his investigation. Hey, well, while we're waiting on your computer, hey, Nevin. Hmm? Anything interesting happening? Well, they bought a chimera. They're in a room full of floating gems. Hmm. So far, that's all. All right. Keep me updated. Okay. There's a little monk that keeps beating the shit out of everything. Kess says that's her sister. Kess, she hits harder than you. Kess says to tell her hi if you happen to drop in. <laughs> I'm not gonna drop in, but okay. <laughs> Twain, wherever the fuck you are, there you are. Roll to 19. Alright. Um, you do notice that there is, like, the energy that's holding the gems aloft is divine energy. Um, and it seems to be seeping into the the pedestals and leaving the room. Mm -hmm. Looks like somebody's siphoning this divine energy off. Wow. So, if we turn it off, they won't have the churchy energy. Right. So do we need to just grab oh. the gems? Do you think it'd be that easy? <laughs> I don't know, but it's... <laughs> there. You go ahead. You go try and grab it. Go ahead. Bessie is going to try. Which one are you grabbing? All right. Um, for a second, you cannot take your hand off of it, and you feel it draining energy from you. Don't drain this away from her. <laughs> and Damn it, it! No. And then it lets you go, and it disappears. It disappeared. Yep. Okay. What did you do? What did you it, do? It felt like something. What did you do? Cannot be good. Okay, touching is bad. <laughs> Thank you, Celine. <laughs> what? So neither knows exactly what's going on with the magic. <laughs> yes, they're using this to um, power up the resurrection. We need to turn this off! Oh no, like, when, As <laughs> when Aspasia touched it, that gave them extra energy. You need some extra energy! Max her on the arm! Should I roll a attack since she's a monk? If you want to. Sore! <laughs> so, I'm sorry! Okay, I get it, I did wrong! Uh-huh, we need to shut it down. They're using this to charge up whatever they're doing. It's a battery. This is the battery. And you just jack up the battery. <laughs> I'm sorry. You go sit in the corner. Sit in the corner. You're not Nobody in charge. Touch anything. <laughs> Then how do we so shut like, it down? Well, Cass's sister's smarter than her, too. <laughs> <laughs> Please take 
thing on Cass. <laughs> when you get so back, we... I'm gonna punch you. You can try. I like you, my little monk friend. Eris <laughs> mm-hmm. so, goes over to Nida. Do you destroy the pedestals? It'll be okay. What? Destroy what they're floating over. Do you think that'll Would help? She know this. Does she know how to um, get it shut off? You do know that the energy is flowing through the pedestals, but you do not know for sure that that will work. Because I think we have someone who has a lot of pent-up energy <laughs> that would uh, love to uh, attack. Fine. I'm going to try to destroy the other purple one, since that's the one that's missing. It's going to take your sword and crack at the base and see what happens. Okay. Roll an attack. I am trying. <laughs> <laughs> She was just giving Ebony a way to vent her frustration on not getting to hit the Chimera. Maybe if I'm going to let Ebony roll. Yeah. All right. Um. The pedestal cracks and you can see some of the energy sort of spilling out of it. It doesn't appear to be uh, going to where it was going before. It's just gonna bust the pedestal up. Yep. See what happens. It falls apart. <laughs> what happens to the gym? It just sort of lands on top of it. Like so whatever, just tr- whatever energy was holding it up is gone now. She's just going to reach out and poke the gym. Nothing happens. She's going to take the gym. All right. <laughs> you have a purple gym. <laughs> so destroying the pedestal before we touch the gym seems to work. Not going to say I didn't make this room specifically to taunt Evan with. Ebony's got a purple gem. Yeah. A giant ass purple gem for no reason. Dawn's trying to destroy the red oh, one. Hold on. Let me put that Ebony has a giant purple gem. <laughs> you kind of cracked it a little, but not much. Tries to get it again. A little more. <laughs> okay. Um, hmm. okay. You're getting there. <laughs> Okay, now it falls Nida, apart. why do you think you can punch the pedestal away? Alright, Dawn, you, you killed yours, finally. Okay, she's gonna poke at her gem, too. I just punched the pedestal! Nothing happens. Alright, we're punching okay. the pedestal. Uh, yeah. Picks up the gem. Has a red gem. It's, it's opening up. It falls apart. The gem falls down. It's the blue gem. <laughs> you feel it take a little bit of energy, <clears throat> but then after a second, it. but then after a second, it flows back into you. Oh. Like it was trying to do what it was meant to do, but it didn't have any connection. So it's like, no, you can have it back. Okay, she's like, okay. It's funny to watch Nida. Eric is going to bust up a freaking pedestal with her fist. Er- Eris is gonna crush Shillelagh. Look! Do not touch anything, Eris. She's just trying to help bust stuff up! Points to the angry paladin who wants to kill things. Okay. <laughs> I- all I did was hit once. It didn't even do that much damage. Oh, yeah, Gloria, you, you killed it. Good girl. Yes. So, of course, it would happen to my character. <laughs> what did you do? Well, Gloria destroyed 
the pedestal that the gem is on, and then she reached out to pick it up, and it sapped all of her energy. <gasps> and then it disappeared. That's darn it! Make sure the gems are done! And is Gloria on the ground passed out? Yes, yeah. look, something for you to do. Yeah. Gloria's unconscious. Where is she? Oh, there she is. I could not see her! Ebony's like, look, something for you to do. <laughs> Dawn! Nida is going to go over to the other blue gym, and she's going to try to bust that one up. Okay. <laughs> Dawn has a red Ebony's going to bust the red one. Okay. Aspasia's going to try... Did Ebony, like, demolish? Uh, yes. It, it's, it's very, very dead. Pokes the gym. Nothing happens. This is because Ebony doesn't pick it up. She literally pokes it. <laughs> Nothing happens. <laughs> you nat 20 on yourself. Yeah, and I nat 1 on Ebony. What happens? It's because the um, dice knew not to hurt St. Claire. It, it's three more because she is a life cleric. Oh, okay. What happened? Don't touch the gems. <laughs> Everybody else is they're, touching them. They're poking them before they touch them, though. So any residual effect that they might have gets wasted on an inanimate object. <laughs> be over here. Be, take it better. easy. Dawn is, Dawn's going to uh, a be a little... Her. She's the cleric mom. <laughs> Math. Yes, it's dead. Folks. Not longbow. Make, make the long sword. Yeah, nothing happens, Ida. You're good. She's got both the blue gems! <laughs> uh, yes. Sorry. It's, it's damaged, but it's still there. Need help? I'm getting it. You've got it. Pokes it with the sword. <laughs> it tries to attach to the sword, but can't, so it just falls into the, the <laughs> dirt. <laughs> Grabs the gem after it's done. This is why everybody's been poking. <laughs> is there any left? No, that's it. Okay. So they okay. cut that battery off? Yay? Mm-hmm. I have a red gem and a white gem. Ebony has a purple and a red. And Nida has two blue. Don't know if that means anything to Becca, but... Nope. They just have pretty gems now. And Nevin's incredibly upset. <laughs> <laughs> he is very mad at Becca right now. Love you. He is very mad at you. <gasps> um, okay. Are we ready to go? Hold on. Is all the radiant energy gone? Is there any energy, or magic energy coming from anywhere near this room? Um, Why are you so good at Arcana? <laughs> the two pedestals that the gems took energy from, okay. that, that took energy from evil, they're still fueling energy in. Even like, though one of them's damaged? Yeah. Like, there's still energy going. Those two are still making energy. I don't know how to turn it off. Break it. Spatial. Well, the one's destroyed. So how do we turn the energy off in that one? Ebony, I don't think that will work. But sure. This one's... The one that's destroyed and sending radiant energy? Mm-hmm. Because they need the radiant energy, right? What's it doing? The question was not answered. Okay. <laughs> radiant asked, energy is, yes, they, they need radiant energy. And if they're doing a resurrection... Do they need the necro necrotic energy too, or just radiant to resurrect? 
They need both. But to turn off radiant energy, what kind of energy would you need? Yeah, he'd need necrotic. So just a little bit of necrotic to shut it down? You can try. Okay. She's going to reach down. Do you mind, young lady? Hi. Hi, cat. Hi, cat. No, go away. Of course, a little bit. Shh. You're at the, where the white one was? Uh, the one she's next to, yeah. Okay. Um. Because that base is already destroyed. Yeah. It takes in the necrotic energy and then all the energy coming from it just fades away. Okay. So it, it worked for the purpose of what she was trying to do. Yes. Oh, by the way, Ebony has some flick wounds. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. Yes, Ebony, I know. The one time it doesn't matter what the to hit is. Actually, it does matter. Uh, well, what did you roll? The DC is a 10. <laughs> awesome! Let's see. Anyway, so we're, we destroyed the other base and turned that one off. Oh, I didn't even see as fast here. Rolling shit. <laughs> yes, the other one is off. So the whole entire battery is down now? Mm-hmm. Yep. Okay. So no more church energy? No more church energy. Is there narcotic energy strong in either from that door too, or do they need to go back up? No, there's. you can still feel really strong necrotic energy. So all doors lead to necrotic. Yep. All doors lead to necrotic. Okay. So we can just go through that door then. Mm -hmm. um, anybody good with doors? Yeah. Naya, right. weren't you good at picking locks? No. <laughs> <laughs> she sort of good at picking locks. What is Gloria, by the way? She's a sorcerer, but she does have these tools. Oh, okay. Let's investigate the door first. She's just like, I could, but I'm going to take a nap. <laughs> Gloria, don't fall asleep. I'm tired. Come on now. Nope, I don't think there's anything wrong with this door. Nope, it's just a locked door. Doesn't trust anything in this place anymore, so she's just like, somebody else, look at the door. <laughs> you, lady who touches things who shouldn't touch things, touch the door. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Not high enough. It's a door that's locked. Why don't you try to unlock it? Oh, for goodness sake. She doesn't have a thing to allow her to... Get out from under Nevin. <laughs> you are not a person that goes next to Nevin. Everybody thinks they go next to Nevin, though. It's not trapped, guys. But don't you pass out on us. And now it's unlocked. There you go. Somebody Dawn else... is helping her. Somebody else can go through it. I'll go through... Dawn is helping Gloria. Well, that is going to try to go through. No, oh, I should probably get rid of the door. Hi. Stop. Okay, hold on. Cracks open the door. Peeks in. Peeks in. <laughs> She's going to roll perception. Mm-hmm. No, Nida, you wouldn't even open the door first. You try to peek in through the keyhole. Then you do the door. <laughs> yes. Oh, Nida. I thought there could be something directly on the other side of the door. <laughs> Nida has played too many video games. Yes. And watched too many horror movies. Yes. So peeks it through the keyhole. Okay. It 
the hallway. Opens the door. Peeks in. It's an empty hallway. It's a dark, mm. empty hallway. It's dark in here. <laughs> Can I help for you? It is not bedtime yet, young lady. <laughs> um, I can't see anything. It's dark. <laughs> Dawn. Oh, wait. Yeah. <laughs> Forgets that she can turn her fist to fire now. <laughs> um. You can now see the hallway. <laughs> it's still there's empty. A door. There's yeah. a door in front of me. The door, and then there's the hallway going down. Um, she's gonna Arcana check the door to see if it's like super, super strong, <laughs> spooky boo energy. Not this time. It's spooky energy, but feels about the same. <laughs> Can Aspasia check? Can certainly try. It's super spooky. Um, like that's, that's that's Spook Central. I think that's Spook Central. So we need to go in there then. Um, <laughs> let somebody else go there first. <laughs> Roll perception. Yes. Huh? Roll perception. Perception. Mm -hmm. Aspasia, you hear some noises from down the hall. Away Light from up. the door. Get back in that room and put that fist out. She puts her fist out. She goes, but she does not go in the room. Somebody's coming. <laughs> <laughs> she just goes, <laughs> and vanishes. Spacia also vanishes. <laughs> <laughs> Why isn't your card up, girl? <laughs> Bessia might be against the wall. Nevin's gonna go to the hallway. Through the air ducts, yeah? Yeah. Okay. He still needs to roll. So. He did. Okay. 27. It's the only reason he moved. <laughs> If I can get him to move. Fights with him. Ah. No, go down here. Go past Claire. Just just to light up this part down here a little bit there. No, stay close enough that you can hear her. Okay. Yeah, they're both probably pressed against walls, so. Yep, she just passed through. She's just like, hmm. So you didn't notice the other door was open? Nope. What's the rule of the insidious perception ever? Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> little that one. No. She not tuned. <laughs> just as bad. We're happy. Can we see in the room? No, Nina, you cannot sneak into the room after her. She locked I don't the, see what. She locked the door back. Could we see inside? Was it open long enough for somebody to get in? Um, roll dex. Okay. I'll let Nida do this. No, don't let Nida do it. No. <laughs> we can also roll perception. Hold on. Cat, stop whatever the hell you're doing. It's annoying. Well, that is good, but... Hold on, I was trying to roll Nida as well card clothes on me. Because I'm trying to get this thing over here to go be good. Cat, why don't you go warm up the bed for mommy? Go lay down. <laughs> Alright, Nida, um... Oh! You saw a really big coffin in the room. Oh, shit. <laughs> Booky room. She peeks in 
this door. Get out from underneath the sweatsuit. Yeah. She peeks in the door and she goes, "There's a giant coffin in that room." And, and a- with blonde hair and purple shit just walked into that room. Think she's wearing purple? We're definitely in the right place. Excuse me, people. Uh huh. So they went this way. It's in there. Should we go in there? <laughs> I, I suppose so. Should, should we go this way? Or should we see if there's another way in? Or do you just want to go in this room? Opinions, anyone else? Nobody has. They're all looking to Jacilla for her opinion because she's the leader well, of this. Open the door then. Is the door locked? The door is yeah. locked. Claire locked it back when she went through it. No, Dex, not, don't roll your weapon. <laughs> you, oh, please! You opened the door. <laughs> you destroyed the lock. I lost the that 20! That lock is very dead. It'll be okay, Danny. Let's just still go first, though. Because <laughs> if anybody's going to announce their presence, it should be her, right? Uh huh. Just probably let you guys in the room, too. Maybe. Are you sure she came in here? There's no one here. There's a giant coffin, though. That's true. Night is in a roll perception. Hi. Because maybe Drusilla rolled perception, but she just rolled shitty perception. (laughs) Uh, Drusilla rolled a 29 perception. Okay, so there's nobody in there. There's nobody in this room. Just a giant coffin. Should we look in the coffin? Should we look in the coffin? Are you sure you want to be that close if there is something spooky that'll come out of that? I am not afraid! Why are you all so cowardly? He won't hurt you. Ah, fuck's sake. So she's gonna push the lid off the coffin. Alright. Strength. I know. She's gonna attempt to push the lid off the coffin as soon as it will let me roll strength. Hi guys. Hi. Who are you hiding at? I'm at twenty. What? Stuff happened. What happened? Stuff. You'll find out okay. shortly. Yeah, that's enough. The coffin is empty. We failed. Would anybody like to roll investigation? Yeah, and Ida will, considering she just opened the coffin. Let me get her card back up. Ebony was rolling perception down the other hall. <laughs> ah. <laughs> because she's... Not in the room. Yeah, the hole just turns and goes on and it appears to be empty. You don't hear anything down there. I gotta get Twain out of that room. <laughs> <laughs> but Nida's like, me, I am in... Impo- Nida, Aspasia! <coughs> what is the point in Nida rolling now? She could still net 20. Mm-hmm. No. It's a big empty coffin, because you actually do have to net 20 to find anything. I almost net 20 Almost. You know, you know who might find something? 
The person who's not gonna look. The what? The person who's not gonna look. Oh, who will look after they leave. Oh. <laughs> Gloria didn't find shit. Hold on, I'm trying to get Twain in the room. I'm gonna go sit over here. <sighs> Alright, Twain, you roll investigation. Ebony still doesn't feel like sh everybody should be in the damn room. Iris. Yeah? Roll inside on Gloria. And Dawn, since you moved next to her. Eh. You notice that next to the coffin, she looks even more drained than she did before. Okay, you two, out. What? Out. Picks her up. Or just, like, shoving her out towards the door. Ebony, you kind of have to... No, you're Not gonna that way. Th back to the room that they were in before. Yeah, Ebony has no idea. What is going on? I don't like it that Gloria was in here. She looked... Even worse. That's not what I was trying to do. Keep shoving her down the hall into the room. Uh, stop shoving me. Not until you're feeling better. And Dawn's just like, what are you doing? <laughs> trying to save her life. Now shove. Shoves her. Falls over. <laughs> <laughs> if you would just walk I don't know how you're going to investigate from the air ducts but you're going to try okay Dawn don't let her pass this door <laughs> cleric <laughs> something's wrong still thinks it's funny that Nevin rolls better investigation from an air duct than everybody did <laughs> down there. <laughs> Aries didn't get to do investigation. Hush you, let me have my glory. <laughs> well, Aries, investigate. <sighs> nope. It's okay. Just let investigate it again and saw it. What is it? The trapdoor. Um, should we go down? Do you want to? Nevin's thinking, fuck, can't stay up here to follow them. <laughs> Fine. I think he we kicks open the air vent. <laughs> I think we need to send Gloria back. Hold on, I see these. That's so... That's so. so what's going on, Nevin? He's just gonna hop down out of the air vent. Since he couldn't get out as gracefully, he's gonna kind of drop himself down and then drop himself down. Like, do the air suspension thing where his feet are swinging then fall to the ground. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he's not, like... What are you doing here? Being nosy. What are you doing here? Oh, the same thing! Look at that. I can't stalk you if you go down a fucking trap door. Let's go. You guys going down the <laughs> trap door? Yes! <laughs> of course we are! I think we need to send Gloria back. Nida. Okay, fine. I will stealth down the trap door. <laughs> Wait, it's for it to roll her stealth. <laughs> Come on, computer. 
that's not as bad as I was anticipating. Spassy is going with the monk. Alright. Not as gracefully. <laughs> After you, Drusilla. Get back at a second. She's opening cards. Oh, God. Oh. Are we not supposed to go down the trap door? Go down the trap door. Go for it. I'm you'll, so scared. You'll find out what the nut 20 means down there. Shit, nope. He, he's like, you first. <laughs> Aerith he, is... like, tripped into the coffin. Then he just stood there and he's like, nope. You go first. If you'll give me a second. He's still a little disoriented from um jumping down out of the room. <laughs> what does Dawn have to do to make Gloria better? I don't think you have the right spell. I don't think you're at high enough level. Lesser resto? Greater resto? You know who does have it? Drew! <laughs> the person Drew. no one's asked. But... Eris is trying to say, would you mind going and looking at, the, at Gloria before we go down? Um, we might need her. Goes, heals Gloria, comes back. <laughs> <laughs> uh, kind of yes, doesn't. You can, uh, let's just have everyone attempt to still. Oh, god damn, Twain. Random rolls I give you. Drusilla, you... Stealth, even though you're disadvantaged. Good girl. Helps. Is Gloria Gloria's looking better now? Uh huh. Okay. We should go see what the others found. Yep. Are you coming, Ebony? I'm coming. I'll follow you, I'll go. Tries to go through door. Can't move. <laughs> Dawn's in the way. Sorry, I'm trying. Can Dawn, I? can you still? <laughs> nope. Wait, don't you have... Yeah, she has strength of the gods. She's not supposed to be disadvantaged. She's still she... well, she rolled a 16. That's stealthy-ish. She's more stealthy... Than Aspasia. Than Aspasia. Aspasia has been waiting there. She might try to re-stealth before she moves. Mm -hmm. uh, Livia, are you coming? Yes. Becca's got lots the of things. The fuck was your... Not, you're not disadvantaged, Ebony. Well, her... her other role was one better, so. I'm gonna go turn off that disadvantage before it pisses me off. Yeah. <laughs> like I did with Dawn. Dear God. Normal. Normal. Alright, anyway. Mm -hmm. yeah. No, go to normal. Be good. Go to normal. Be normal. You guys are going down. Hold on. I'm not prepared. I have one more person who's going to try to stealth again. <laughs> now that everybody else has gone down the hole. <laughs> Eris is just... Huh? Eris can't stealth. Well, you still did better than Asphestia did originally. Get your ass down there. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Come on, Evan. This is why he needed me. We still have better together? <sighs> Shira's granting him inspiration because it's Shira. Well, he's still feel better than some people. And yet, somebody sees everybody but Ebony. Really? Can you guess who? Claire? No. She saw, like, nobody. Apollyon. Apollyon saw everybody but Ebony. 
Lovely to see you all again. I think we failed. <laughs> Indeed. Indeed. Thank you, Gloria, dear. Uh, what? It was you that brought me back. Oh, well, this is a bunch of fuck. <laughs> Wait, who actually killed Apollyon? Who got the final blow on him? Cass and Cass. Well, technically, Arya, but then they brought him back, and Cass and Cass finished him off together. <laughs> so, yeah. Did he not have a head? Yeah. They, 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 dis him. they destroyed him. That, that's why the divine energy was needed. <laughs> Claire could bring back his body, but she couldn't regrow the head. I have no idea who any of these people are. Me either, so you're not alone. <laughs> Spacia. You should know who some of these people are, Twain. Especially the one The question who... was, when he was on Durin, did he care who anyone but Apollyon was? Yes, he knows who everybody is. Okay, good boy! <laughs> Dawn is kind of standing... Going to protect Drew. Uh-huh. You're standing under Drew. I can't help... I can't move her. My computer is being stupid. Twain kind of just grabs Dawn and moves her here. Don't be an idiot. Is what he says. <laughs> this can roll perception on Drew if you like. Motherfuck. No, Becca, bad. What? Nope. Eris can't see shit. Well, that'd be great if you were performing. Dawn! <laughs> Dawn sees whatever's happening. Hold on. She's kind of paralyzed. Twain, get her out of here. Get Lady Drew out. My wife is a queen, not a lady. You're not going to touch her. Keyleth, there's a bit of a problem. They brought Apollyon back. Lovely. Tells Harmony. Ugh. Yeah. Ow. Ow. What are you trying to do, Harmony? Shut up. So, there's actual, actual lights down there? Sure. I don't know. Could have been candles, could have been electrical, thought I'd ask. There's actual lights. It's a modern day apartment building. They've just kind of refurbished it for their use. Alright. Wonders how fast everyone can run. Just turns and does nothing because he can't find the electric panel. <laughs> Should have investigated first. Found the electrical panel! Yep. Bet you did. No. Roll again. Turns the lights out and unlocks everything that's electrical. <laughs> Can anyone actually carry Drew away? <laughs> I don't know. Is anybody strong enough? That's yeah. a good question! Aspasia took her and ran. <laughs> Yes, you managed to rip her from Apollyon's arms. And <laughs> runs with her. <laughs> he really doesn't like you. Does not care! <laughs> so they're all running because it's dark. Yep. yep. Just so. to have everybody roll... Uh, uh, just roll athletics. Does Nevin have to? You're running, yes. Ah! <laughs> I'd much rather have rolled acrobatics. 
six. Eris can't run. <laughs> Can the stealth help cover up the fact that he's not running as fast because everybody's in his damn way? Sure. <laughs> okay. Twain, can you run? Thank you. You're no. There. But you're right by the door, so. Doesn't help that everybody's still there. It kind of blocks everybody else from running as quickly. Well, so- I'm moving you when you pass the DC. Oh. Oh, dear. Did Bessia get out with Drew? Yes. Eris, you made it! <laughs> oh, yeah, Livia, you're good. None of my people are gonna go home. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> 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 was Eris is enough to help Nida get out? No. Why do you keep trying to do that? Do what? Help? Can I can I help with the non Nat twenty? <sighs> and you said Nevin's stealth was enough to help him get through the crowd? Yes, if I can get to him. Oh, there you go. Okay. He was underneath cards, so I'm, like moving cards, trying to get over there. Yeah, Ebony. Did Ebony beat the DC? You're good, Ebony. Waits for Twain to roll again. Oh, there's Nida next. Yeah, you managed to stealth before Apollyon grabbed you. (laughs) (laughs) Runs up the stairs? Uh Uh-huh. Twain. (laughs) You're pretty. We've met. Have we? We have. Hmm. Right. Should really have him try to run away now. I'm going to, nope, he's not good at stealth. Um, can he try to persuade her that maybe she should look after her brother? Since he did just come back from the dead instead of bothering with them right now. You can try to persuade her. I'm not even Such gonna, persuasion. I'm not even going to roll her inside because she'd have to nat 20 to... Not be persuaded. <laughs> On Wait, everybody else took off running up the steps like a crazy fool. Twain just comes walking up. <laughs> Nida slams the coffin closed. <laughs> After he's out? <laughs> yeah. No, he slams it closed with his with him in it. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. You know. All right, you survived. Yeah. Because you well, didn't. Aren't you happy we didn't fight them back up? Yeah, because they're level twenty. <laughs> Except for Polly. We still haven't gotten our experience points from the Chimera. I'm working on it. Me. Nope. Nice seeing y'all. Goodbye. <laughs> Never the sleeves. Tell my sister I said hi. Oh, fuck. Uh, Cass's sister. She says hi. Um, hi. <laughs> she confusedly says hi back. And now they leave this area. Yep. They're probably That's all going to head true. back to headquarters. Yep. I'm working <laughs> on it. Because we decided to grab her and run. Yep. 
smart. You <laughs> saved Drew! Yay! <laughs> Were saved. you hoping we'd save Drew, Becca? I was hoping you'd save Drew. I was kind of hoping you wouldn't save Gloria. <laughs> Why? Why? Because that would have been fun. No. Sorry, sweetheart. You've been saved. I know. I'm fine with this. It's Becca that's disappointed. Becca! What? Stop being disappointed when we save people! Oh, God, I forgot you like this thing. Hold on. Let me get it on you. Becca. Yes. She wants to massager. <laughs> oh, God, there are so many people. Yes, Becca, and there's going to be more. Yep. No, this has all the people on it. Oh, the one you're looking at? I have to go through and turn off everybody that's not already here. Oh, oh yeah. I'm like, I don't wanna. This is when it would be easier for us to just type it in ourselves when you figure out what it is. Yeah, that would be way easier. Okay, so... Boom! Oh, come here. I have a calculator. <laughs> so they'll tell everybody a polyon's back later. Why not now? Bedtime. Ah. Hi, cat. Hey, baby. <laughs> I don't know if you can see me using the head massager on her, but look! <laughs> look at her butt! Because it's right in your face! <laughs> yep. So everybody got 366 experience. That's so much. Mm -hmm. Well, I had to make it something not too difficult for the lower level people. I'm fairly certain you could have made it a little harder than that, though. <laughs> Probably. Yes, Livia, you're finally a level three paladin. <laughs> you finally leveled up for the first time this campaign. Aren't you glad she rolled to go? <laughs> like, hey, I get to do stuff now. No, Drew, you're not going to level up. Gloria, I don't think you will either. Nope. Cat, I need to level up Twain. You need to move your ass. Nevin, you didn't participate in the fight. You don't get points. I did save everybody. You didn't participate in the fight, and you didn't help solve the puzzle. But I did save everybody. You can have 50 points for that. Okay. <laughs> Nevin. Bargaining for experience points. Nevin. Yes. I love you. <laughs> no, you don't, because you get me away from that puzzle. You could have dropped down and helped at any point. Nah. It was your choice not to help. It was not what I was instructed to do today. My leader is way scarier than theirs. I'm not trying to be scary. Are we talking about Apollyon? I'm not quite sure who's scarier, Harmony or Apollyon at this present moment in time, considering Harmony has a 50-something corruption. <laughs> no, Drusilla was asking I'm not trying to be scary Because Drusilla is apparently the leader of this little group Yep You're welcome yeah, so She's like, eh I know I'm a queen and all, but That's what queens do They lead Drew I've been dead for six months I'm a little rusty 
You'll get the hang of it. I just think it's funny that Twain persuaded himself out of being captured. Yeah. <coughs> I'm a sucker for a pretty face. And he is very pretty. He's mine. <laughs> Hi, Andromeda. <laughs> it's like, we have two kids now. Yep. Oh, by the way, Selena, Andromeda got another kid. Yep. Oh. Yeah, Janice. Anyway. Yep. So now she's got three kids. I guess this is where we're gonna wrap up for the night. Oh yeah, Celine, say all that shit before Beck actually hits stop. Okay. If you like this, please hit the like button and leave us lovely comments down below. We'll accept not so lovely comments too. And don't forget to hit subscribe so that you can be up to date. And hit the bell so that you'll know when we update. Oh, you mean the notification button, Celine? Yes, the bell. It's a bell. Also, D and D Girls is on Tumblr and Twitter. Look us up and follow. If you want to know what crazy looks like, this is what crazy looks like. Bye. <laughs> Bye. 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 We're done.